Hello. Uh, I thought I'd do a, a video especially for my Patreon uh, subscribers. Uh, so I, I'm, I'm doing a video at the moment um, about um, slope, about the one in three slope around an organic pool. Um, so I just thought I'd just show you behind the scenes. There's not really much to see, you know. This is, um, this is part of my lighting kit. It's a, a bit of um, insulation. Um, the sun's moved around a bit, so I need to readjust that, but that's bouncing a bit of light to fill in um, and, you know, make me look really good. Um, this is my camera. Um, so this, this here is the demonstration I'm doing at the moment because um, sometimes it's, it's really um, good to see something in practice and I'm always going on about a one in three slope. And the reason for a one in three slope around an organic pool is because it can get you down to a metre depth um, without any building. So if you wanted a two metre deep pool, then you have uh, a one metre high concrete wall that comes up from the base, then it meets this slope, and then the other metre is taken up by the slope. And because it's nice and slopey, um, slopey um, then that will be perfect for, uh, for the plant filtration and a whole variety of different plants. So, um, so the one in three is actually to help uh, the, the wildlife or the f flora, um, as well as helping you build less and making the pool cost less. Anyway, um, but a one in three slope, some people are really confused that how does gravel stay on a one in three slope? Because surely it'll all just slide down. But this is just to show uh, that it does actually just stay there. Um, <clears throat> So this is a one in three slope, and there we go, and it's, it, it, it's on there. Now, um, oh, let, let me, uh, let, let's just go backwards a second. If you, if you have a, um, pour a heap of sand or gravel, it'll be like that on the ground, yeah? And uh, that angle there is the angle of recl reclination. Now, normally for sand and gravel, it's about 30 degrees. Okay, uh, if it's um, if it if it's solid rock, of course that angle of reclination, reclination will be 90 degrees. Um, if it's water, it will be zero degrees. You're not going to get that standing up. But um, sand and gravel basically will end up at that sort of angle if you just pour it naturally. So if we have an angle that's less than 30 degrees say 20 degrees then it will stay there no problem now 20 degrees is roughly what a one in three slope is so one meter down three meters long so that's it and just to show if I if I tip this up to about 30 degrees the whole thing will just start moving anyway that's the idea so it's just a illustrate that as you come back to the blackboard what most people this is the profile of a standard pool and this is the one in three slope so down one meter depth there this other meter is just taken up by this concrete block wall okay um, what a lot of people do is make a, a big mistake now I include myself in this um, because I've done pools before like this well, I'm going to say when I've done pools before, I mean, my first pool was like this and it was a blinking disaster because, okay, I'm getting down one meter over a three meter width, but it's too steep here and all the stuff slides off. Yeah. Conversely, some people make pools like this, uh, like that. Um, and then it's, it's just too steep here. Um, but there's a whole variety of different of different shapes you can come up with, but basically none of them work. What you need is a straight line, and then the gravel will stay there. You won't have a different ingredient all the way along the pool, so it's got to be consistent. So the straight line. Uh, hopefully that's helped clear it up. Um, so there we go. There's a, a bit of um, inside information on uh, what I'm working on at the moment, and hopefully you'll find this information useful because getting this right is really key to making the pool effective the edges are you know are, um, 
are really, really important, and this will help you get a really good edge. You don't want any of this nonsense. Anyway, hope that helps.